So this is my piece, The Human Heart. Uh, my name is Sienna Morris. I am a numberism artist. I started numberism back in 2008, and I just wanted to quickly show you what this heart is drawn with. This bigger one here is a limited edition. This is actually the size of the original. I can put my hand here so you can see the size relation. So it's fairly large. This is also the color of the original. It took me seven months to draw, and it's drawn with math and science that explains the function of the human heart. It's actually equations a cardiologist would use to ascertain the health of your heart, and the placement of the numbers is important here. Um, again, this is originally done by hand, so this is pen and colored pencil. So here in the main body, we have stroke volume, which you can see here. This is stroke volume equals N diastolic volume, subtract N systolic volume. That's for most of this area here. I'm trying to get you the biggest, the best image here for seeing this through my phone. Um, and then we have out to the lungs up here in blue is ejection fraction. Coming back in from the lungs is oxygen content of the blood. As you can see, I've abbreviated some of it. Out through the aorta, I have a cardiac output and ejection fraction. And you can see the formula for this really clearly too. So Q is for cardiac output and it equals uh, stroke volume times heart rate. I also have ejection fraction in here. Um, the great coronary vein and all of the veins in this piece is a chemical formula for norepinephrine, which helps regulate heart rate among other things. And you can see it really clearly there actually getting better image of it than I thought it would. And then this here is the inferior vena cava. The superior vena cava up here, both of them are drawn with oxygen difference. Um, and then my favorite part is the right atrium here. You see the inside of it. This is the beginning of the electrical system of the heart, which I found most fascinating with research researching it. This is the sinoatrial node and the atrial ventricular node, also known as the SA and AV node. Over here is the His bundle. Um, the atrial ventricular node is drawn with its average firing rate. It's going to get really hard to see these numbers. There you go. And then the sinoatrial node is my favorite. It's the only self-firing cell in the human body. It's drawn with its membrane potential, which regulates that mechanism by opening and closing ion channels. It's based on the conductance inside and outside of the membrane. Um, it's the only cell in the body that does this. I find it totally awesome. So this is the large format limited edition. I'm offering this at my auction. It's called Making Room for the Brain. In fact, there's a little brain down there on the floor. Um, it's to make room for and to fund my current research into the brain. This 32 by 40, these starting price of the auction is going to be 500 right? I believe so. And the buy now price will be 2000 um, You can bid at the show. It's July 31st and August 1st from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. You can also call in bids. I'll be listing the phone number on my website soon. Um, this, you, this piece usually goes, I think, for around 800 I'm sorry, I should know these numbers better. But the starting bid will be 500 and the buy now price will be uh, 2000 and this one down here, I just wanted to show you. This is a smaller limited edition. This is a uh, 24 by 30. Both of these are on gallery bars, by the way. Um, this one is, that particular piece, I believe, is 19 of 20. That edition is almost closed. I will not be offering that at the show, but just to show you the difference in size and color. And that's it. So if you guys come to the show, I would I really appreciate it. Um, all the pieces that sold in the show will support my research into the brain. I plan on setting the brain for at least a year, I'm doing an entire series on it, and I'm looking to get some more hands-on experience. So I'll be getting things like microscopes, eyeballs, hopefully making my own EEG, um, and I would very much like to get an fMRI of a brain for my piece. And as I'm closing this out, I'm just going to show you some more numbers real quick. So this is the heart. Um, you can also find it on my website, fleetingstates.com. Thanks for watching. Go science.